have been doing a lot of different things with my face and um i'll do my makeup in front of my friends and they're like you didn't put that in your tutorial so i decided to do an updated everyday glam this is my winter routine since in the winter time i get a little light since i'm in the midwest i just wanted to share with you all my new tricks and hacks on how i achieve this beautiful face <laughs> so i'm gonna use this smashbox photo finish foundation primer to prime my face before I apply my foundation. Then I go into my Anastasia Beverly Hills palette. I know it's busted. <laughs> and I'm gonna use the warm coral color to color correct using my finger. By the way, this contour kit is in the shade medium. I'm gonna go back into the Anastasia Beverly Hills um, contour kit and I'm gonna use the color cream. And I'm gonna place that cream color on top of all the places that I color corrected. So I'm using this NARS foundation, the um, medium dark in Katie's and this is the all day luminous foundation and I do like it because it's so weightless so now I'm going to use my beauty blender just to further blend my foundation and I just use a damp beauty blender and just tap it around my face just to pick up that extra foundation. Now I'm gonna go back into my Anastasia contour kit and use the color chocolate to contour my face. Then I'm using my MAC Pro Longwear in the color NC42 and I'm going to conceal my face. So the reason why I do my contour and my concealer um, at the same time is because I like to let my, my light sit on my face for a little bit because it just, um, it doesn't move as much. So now I'm gonna take my damn beauty blender, spray it with my pepper prime spray, and blend my concealer. The reason why I put the concealer on my eyes is because I'm not using um, eyeshadows today. So I'm still gonna prime my eyes with the leftover concealer onto my eyelids so I can have like a neutral eye. Now I'm going to take this Galici Glam brush to um, smooth out these harsh lines. I got this brush for free from Lily Lashes from, I guess, spending a lot of money. And I absolutely love it because it helps to blend my cream, contour, and concealer. So now I'm going to take the same beauty blender that I used to blend out my concealer and I'm going to apply my Laura Mercier setting powder. So I've mentioned in some tutorials, but I'm gonna say it again. I don't let the loose powder sit under my eyes or under my nose or on my forehead. The only place I let the setting powder set is right here. And that's just to strengthen my contour. So I take 
a little bit on my brush like this and I probably like tap it off like that and then I'll just apply that and then keep going back and forth until I don't see any loose powder and I do that to like my entire face except for right here I think the main objective is just to make sure that it doesn't look cakey on your face I also set my eyelids so anywhere I put light concealer so if you guys have been watching my channel you guys know that I'm absolutely in love with this wet and wild eyeliner um, a liquid eyeliner has become my best friend now you know and that's what I love about makeup you can just change what you use and and think that used to not work for you before may work for you now so I'm just going to add a thin line of eyeliner because I want a more natural look. So I never apply my lashes on camera, but I'm going to show you the type of lash I'm using. I'm using it from Lily Lashes and it was actually like a sample lash that they sent out and it wasn't um, a name on it so I don't know the name but I'm absolutely in love with these I use them every time I go somewhere and I want to look glam but not too made up and I want to wear mink lashes so this is a lash look pretty and so what I do when I apply my lashes I'm just going to tell you guys my process I would add the glue onto my eyelash and the eyelash glue I use is this lash grip beauty supply store glue I add that to my lash and I let it get a little tacky so while I'm waiting for it to get tacky I'll add my um, mascara and then after I do that I'll just fan it a little bit and apply my lash so I'll be right back and I'm about to go apply my Queen Collection mascara onto my lashes and then these beautiful lashes after I apply my lashes I apply this to my bottom lash and I'm gonna go into my matte contour kit and I'm gonna use this dark color to deepen my cream contour So I used my brush with the leftover contour and I deepened my eyelid contour. I mean, <laughs> what, are, what is this called? So I'm taking the brush and I'm adding some darker, cons um, you know, darker color to my eyelids to deepen the contour because I mentioned before I have hooded eyes. So I just want that sunken in look. Now I dust off the beard. Now I take my CoverGirl Classic Color Blush. I used to not be a blush girl, but I like the way it just adds color to my face now. So I just apply like a little bit because I do not like that rosy cheek blush look. It's not for me. I'm going to go into my Anastasia Bobbly Hills Glow Kit and I'm going to take the color Sun Ray and I'm going to apply that for my highlight. So now that I'm finished with my face, I just take my MAC Pep and Prime, Prep and Prime Spray. I don't know what's wrong with me today. I'm just going to set my face before I start on my lips. So now I'm gonna take this e.l.f. lip scrub and it's kind of like a lipstick and I just use that to scrub my dry lips. I don't do this every time because if you scrub your lips too much they'll start to peel and bleed and crack and you do not want that. Then I rub that off. Now I'm gonna take this Victoria's Secret Lip Plumper and after I scrub my lips, I add this to my lips just to make them look a little fuller. It's usually like instant. Look at 
that looks like lip injections. Then I'm gonna rub that off after I let that sit on my lips for about a minute or two. I'm gonna take my MAC Cork Lip Pencil to outline my lips. Then I take this NYX color in the color Cairo. I'm gonna take this MAC Lip Glass from the Mariah Carey Collection and add that on top of the next. 